Yo, what's up, DB? Paper Mario. For the highlight video, in case I make this a November highlight video, I haven't streamed TTYD at all. I've just been 100%ing all the Paper Mario games, and uh, I wanted to play the best TTYD chapter for, for the fans, you know? The, the, the one with the funny ghost man. This is the pipe of the awesome variety. Uh, yeah, we gotta go talk to Frankly. I probably should have done like the preparation stuff first. Uh, by the way, I, I genuinely just like stopped playing TTYD for a day just so I could uh, just so I could do this chapter on stream without playing any of the other ones. Chapter four. You guys know how to count, right? See, because I never learned how to count since I'm since I'm number one. For pigs, the bell tolls. Ah, and this place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? Hey. It's been a long time since anyone's come from outside. You've come from far away? That's close of yours. I'm pretty sure you guys may be adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurers. Maybe it's the perfect time. Wait, what? A bad thug? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me. Oh gee whiz, I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear. An undertale. And a scary tale to tell, too. Oh no, the bell rang again. Oh, this is so awful. Who could it be now? I can't believe the one that was just talking to us. <laughs> the funny bell rang. I think you mean the devious bell. Who are you, Gramps? I'm the man of this whole town. Some call me Dower. I'm not exactly the sharpest fellow, but I do believe you're adventurers, right? This isn't the place for the telling of tales, sadly. My traveling friends, welcome to Twilight Town. Well, I'd like to welcome you. But welcoming people is generally a good thing, and it's nothing but bad here. What do you mean? This is literally the best area in the game. As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Whoa, cursed? E? Yes, cursed. That's the right word, right? Yes, of course. It is, you see. Beyond town is a forest, and in its heart is an ancient building, the Creepy Steeple. A dark creature who lives there. Its curse ordains that when the bell ste steeple rings, one of the twilighters living in the village becomes a pig. Well, my, will my loved ones become swine? Will I, too, become a curly-tailed orker? I'm so worried, I can't sleep at night. Of course, night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well, the village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. Let me give you some advice. Leave us. Leave before you too get pigified. Not gonna happen, Gramps. We're looking for something important. Maybe you've heard of it. A star-shaped rock called the Crystal Star. Uh, I don't know about any Crystal Star thing, but in Creepy Steeple, there's a glittery red stone shaped like a star. Whoa, are you serious? That's gotta be the Crystal Star. Gotta be. Ah, uh, you people. You aren't thinking of going to Creepy Steeple, are you? <laughs> Unthinkable. Guys, I'm gonna go to the Creepy Steeple, because I think there's gonna be a funny guy there. Whoa, the gate guy's gone. Oops, none, not gone. The stubborn dude's a pig. Hey, wait, that's actually pretty sweet for us. No <laughs> pig's good. Yeah! He got trolled. Anyways, there's a funny thing here. Goombella looking for who asked. Oh, he has a last stand P. Now I want to kill him. Yeah, I did the pit. I'm kind of a gamer. I didn't actually do all Gaming. I know um, not everyone in chat right now knows, like, what just happened. But trust me, it was pretty cool, okay? Ooh, I'll take that. And I'll take this. And what's in here? So many nice rewards that I totally deserved. Oh, that blue's there. I just heard a voice. There's no way that people could... <laughs> Not that voice. It's King Boo. He's in the box. Don't open it, Mario. So pretty, pretty please heart emoji. Oh, thank goodness. You're going to let me out. Yeah. <laughs> we fooled. We, we got kind of trolled. Minor amount of tomfoolery paper. The cursiest curse ever. 
fear my terrible power. You will know the pain of having your body roll up. Be cursed. Wee hee hee, now you're cursed, the loser. Savor your suffering. When this curse strikes you, well, you won't be able to walk. That's how awful it is. Wee hee hee, your suffering amuses me. Now, I, I, now show me your cursed plight so I can laugh all the more. Just press and hold R, then rotate the circle fat repeatedly. Wee <laughs> Your pathetic misery fills me to the core. You must roll around like a silly cardboard tube. Oh, how you'll be laughed at. Now, do you understand the depths of your own agony? Yes. <laughs> Paper! Hey guys, do you like paint? Or <laughs> do you... <laughs> do you like paint? Do you like pain? They put you to sleep, and then they put you to sleep again, and then they put you to sleep again. Devious Daisy. Everything in this chapter is just so devious. Use the devious ghost lady to... To uncover the devious X put down the, by the devious Grotus. Where's the devious X? Oh, the, the brown pound. So you can go into the devious background. <laughs> what am I supposed to do here? Why am I forgetting? This is my fourth favorite game of all time. I literally have two options here. I can ground pound, I can jump, and I can... Oh. Devious rock. I should really equip um, Last Stand and Mega Rush and stuff. Overrated. Creepy steeple. Because when we fight the funny guy... I'm... Now we can go into the, the spooky steeple. After I waste more co I don't have enough coins. Let's play a fun game of Ken Gooms Beat the Atomic Boo with 4 health. Hee hee. Hee hee. Hold on, I need to look up how many ghosts are in this area, because I forgot. Tee hee. -hee. Good, very good. Take this, math nerd. Hey! Yeah, he gives you an Ultra Shroom, and I, uh, that's, that's a decent item, you know? It just heals 50 HP. Are you going to be mean to me? Yes. Go away, mean- Oh, you're supposed to say no. Whoops. Promise? Come on out, guys. Yo, what's that devious guy in that windowsill doing? They spinning. I can spin, too. He, who, he, you said you'd be nice. Let's get him, guys. Spoilers, Fox R. Oh, no. Yeah. Me when I can't flee the optional fight. Is this the, uh, spam A button? Oh. Mario is no more. I always come back. Creepy steeple. See, when I got that, uh, life shroom earlier, that was just foreshadowing. Okay, he literally has two health left. We're good. Ah! No, don't do it, Yoshi! Frank. Anyways. <laughs> devious pouch. <laughs> Dude, Yoshi was just devious to me. Also, you get Lucky Start from them? For some reason, I thought Lucky Start was in the pit. Ba -da -ba 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 -da. Ah! There's so many jump scares in this area. I guess it is the creepy area. <laughs> devious jump scare. That's a swooper. I bet they're called that because the way it swoops around. Wow, that's awesome. The awesome naming work. Seriously, it's pure naming genius. Yo, is this the L is real statue? Whoa, what if the... What if the boss of this area is Luigi? But devious. It's... It, wait, that, no, that's the next game. Steeple key. Alright, let's go. Let's let's just go fight this boss, I guess. 
you know, it's 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 just a filler stream. It, it can be short, but it is the best chapter, you know. Here it comes. Hey, hang on there, slick. He, what are you doing, interrupting my me thing? Whoa, come on, this guy is the monster the mayor is freaking out about? Who are you calling a monster? What's your problem? Why do you need to pick a fight? I'm busy thinking up new pranks and stuff. <laughs> he is a prankster. He is canonically just doing a little trolling. I'm busy thinking up new pranks and stuff. It's not easy either. Now get lost. He's just bored. Duplass is just a funny guy. <laughs> and of course, you guys won't know. Won't. No way you ninnies go away quietly, am I right? Yo, look at him walk. Well, alright then, Slick. Fine. Yes, I turned the villagers into pigs. Big deal. Big deal? You stink, mister. Why do you want to turn them into pigs anyway? <laughs> Slick. <laughs> well. You know, they're all so depressing and boring and dim-witted all the time. So instead of wallowing in gloom, I figured they might as well wallow in mud. Ha! Now they're pigs, get it? Isn't that just so perfect? It's like irony or something. So what, you got a problem with that? Guess you do. So let's play, Slick. <laughs> oh no, did I accidentally say his name? He's just a funny ghost man. Surely his theme would not go that hard. Huh? How totally bizarre. This thing isn't listed in here. There's a monster in here that looks like this thing, but it doesn't list the name. Max HP is 40, attack is 4. It's apparently really good at transforming itself in other things. Maybe it used that power to turn the pigs, the villagers into pigs. This thing's a real jerk. Hey, shut up, Goombella. He's just, he was just bored. Look at him cry. Poor dude. I'm sorry, poor, um, ugh. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I guess I'll get down and dirty if you're gonna play like that, Slick. Ooh, four damage. Goombella, you're a jerk. Yeah, Goombella, screw you. Can I turn Dupless small? Or oh, sorry, can I turn it uh, small? <laughs> look at the look at the funny little guy. He's just a funny little guy. <laughs> Your honor, it was pretty funny. Hmm, <laughs> time to re regroup here. So you think you're a couple of heavies, huh? Well then, my dear friends. If you thought changing folks into pigs was impressive, then you're gonna love this. I got something very special for you here. Was he gonna turn into small Mario? Devious. Aw, oh, he's just normal Mario. How you like them apples? Now that's magic, people. Now you're fighting yourself. Ha! I'm a dang genius. He knows what irony is. He's just so cool. Anyways, um... As funny as he is, he, uh... He has to perish. Can I turn Mario small? <laughs> He's funny. Yup, 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 you got... Hold on. What? What? Huh? You beat me? He just had to go so soon. Poor funny guy. <laughs> Freak Sheet is dead. Yo, Mario's looking a little funny over there. You got a crystal star! Mars, he's just a funny guy. Yeah, look at his, look at those eyes. He's just making a funny face. Mario defeated the scourge of creepy steeple and found the fourth crystal star. People of Twilight Town have surely recovered from their awful curse by now. At this rate, Mario's quest to collect all seven crystal stars will be done in no time. With this back to creepy steeple, Mario sets out towards his bright future. Um, all right, guys. Uh. Yeah, yeah, that's it? That's all you got, man? This guy was a wimp. That's not even fair. Well, who cares, right? We got the crystal star, so let's get out of here. Yeah, that, that ghost guy, he was just a... He was just a nerd. Whoa, I'm purple. 
<laughs> yes, this guy we will take Mario and then yeah, his map. Mario Waluigi now? No, we can't do that until chapter 6. With this super bomb here, there's no way we can fail. No, not likely. Gah. Vivian, hand me that glorious super bomb. Huh? Vivian, don't you dare. Does that huh mean what I think it does? I, I never had it. You were holding it just two seconds ago. You said it was too important to trust me with. Oh, you terrible liar. Stop making up stories to cover for yourself. If you don't have it, then you obviously must have it. Or, if I don't have it, then you obviously must have it. And you obviously lost it. Or are you trying to imply that I lost it, you lollygagging worm? No, no, I know. Of course not, no, no. Well, I can't do much without it now. Now can we? Oh, you're such an idiot. Very well. I'm sure you must have dropped it around here somewhere. So why don't you look for it? Well, Maryland and I go take a well-earned siesta. And if you don't find it, well, you know what'll happen, don't you? I get punished. That's right, you little twit. Come, Marilyn. Let's leave this useless little fool to her chore. Guh. Guh. <laughs> Marilyn is just banjo. Uh, yeah, you know, you don't want to get into a- Oh wait, you lose all your coins, don't you? Or maybe I just didn't have any coins, I don't know. I think it would be really funny if the, the funny guy stole your, your wallet. That's my head cannon. Hey, what's up, Slick? I've been waiting for you. Paper? Oh gosh, dude, he's, he's gone too far. He's gone too far, he's got the paper. Hey, you're Mario, right? What a great name. And I really dig this body, too. Man, I can jump now. And hey, you're super popular around here. I got mob. I just love being you. Yeah, it's so cool. I don't want to ever think to stop. So you figured out by now, right, Slick? Your body and name belong to me now. See, I, I've got the power to change my shape into anyone I want. It comes in handy. But to really be someone, I need to take their name and body, too. Which means you turn into a shadow and can't use your name. Tough break, Slick. That's not enough either. I'm, I aim to erase you. For good. He <laughs> really is devious. I guess it'd be un unsporting to ruin you without a challenge. So I'll give you one chance. If you guess my real name, then I'll, then I'll give you back your name and body. What do you say, Slick? This will be fun, right? Time to cancel you. Now guess what? Now guess. What's my name? Hit me with your best shot. Well, obviously, we know his name is Slick McQuick. Slick MC. That, that's his rapper name. We, we finally found out his... his <laughs> we finally found out his purpose in Mr. Goom's lore. He's just a funny rapper. Ronamundo, little nobody. Who named their kid that? Prepare for doom, Slick. Yuck, yuck, yuck. And I don't even know, and I don't even think about running from battle, you hear? No running. <laughs> Bye. Oh, That's no fun. Sniff, sniff, sniff. What will I do? What will I do? Poor me. I don't have like a definitive voice for Vivian. She's like a fan favorite character, and I just do not have a voice for her. It's in here. Oh wait, it's in here. It's in one of these. Vivian won't, won't Vivian be punished if you... What? You found it? Oh, oh, thank you so much. Thank goodness. Oh, oh, thank you so much. Thank goodness. At least now I won't get punished now. Oh no! It's broken. It must have broken when my sister dropped it. What do I do? What do I do? I guess it's just meant to be punished. I guess I was just meant... Bleh. I guess I was just meant to be punished for life. Here, let me fix it. I'm gonna hit it with a hammer. That usually tends to work. Oh, don't even bother trying. It's really busted. What will I do now, huh? My sisters will be back any minute now. But I do appreciate your offer. Thank you. It, it just dissolves. Hey, wait a second. What's your name anyways? Why don't you tell me? What? I can't hear you. Your name was stolen. I see. I guess that happens from time to time. <laughs> <laughs> he's he's just so devious. He just steals everyone's name now. Wait, no it doesn't. Your name was stolen? That's absolutely crazy. <laughs> devious. G 
Gee whiz, you have way worse problems than I do. You were worried about me that whole time? That's so kind. Alright, that's it. I'm going to help you get your back your name, and your body, and your friends. Hey, that's okay, don't worry about my problems. I'm not sure I really want to stay with my sisters anyways. And I feel like I need to repay you for your earlier kindness. So it's the right thing to do. Oh, <laughs> heart emoji. Here we go. Vivian is you and you're good. Vivian's abilities, a prime. Press X to have Vivian pull. There's sirens outside my house. Vivian real. I guess we need to find out that ghost's real name first. Huh? That'd be a start. Now where are we going to get that kind of information? Yes. That's where we're gonna get it. Oh hey, I sort of have an idea. Birds pretend to be innocent with people around. But they're actually really well informed about all the flying- with all that flying and eavesdropping. With my power, you can listen into their conversations without them knowing. So in addition to villagers, let's try to get some info on the local birds. That's the least I could do for you with my pounds. Isn't there a funny little guy in this ha in this house? <laughs> Yo. Oh, thank you, thank you. We owe you so much, Mario. Please take this as a token of our thanks. Eat up. What's he got to say? Hey, ha, wah, he, wah. Look at me, look at me. It's a me, Mario. Wah, ha, ha, ha. Chris Pratt. I've been really depressed lately, thinking about the depletion of fossil fuels. <laughs> We've gotta come up with a renewable energy source before that happens. <laughs> like wind or hydraulics. I think solar energy is probably the greatest potential. <laughs> Why <is> it... <laughs> Dude, this game is so good. Alas, the twilled world is too full of pain and contradiction. Or, yeah, contradiction. It's too full of broken dreams. Yo, this <laughs> this world is the Paper Mario community. Perhaps I was only given wings so that I could flee from the terror of money. <laughs> Dude, the birds are so awesome. It's a funny chapter. Yeah, this whole chapter is just TVs. How did I strike first? In chapter 7, you go to the moon where you can jump really high. And Vivian will just stretch. That's a power move. Ah! Shout out to the person who made this room. They're, they're truly the most devious part of this chapter. This room is why people say this is the best Paper Mario. <laughs> For a second, you can see Vivian just stretch. Guys, are you ready to get the most important key item of the entire game? Why is there a Mr. Softener? Steeple key. You guys ready for this? The letter P. Scrap? What happened to those weirdos that were just here? Ah, uh, whatever. It was almost nice to have some company. I mean, no matter how important it is to anyone that nobody knows his real name. Locking me up here just because I know it. They make me guard the name's stupid missing letter. No way, true parrot. I really want a cracker. Dupless. You're a really big meanie when it's feeding time, huh? Hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for you. When does he say time to cancel your magazine? Hey, Slick, time to cancel your magazine subscriptions, because you're getting erased. But first, please amuse me with one more guess. It really gives me joy to watch you squirm in futility as you try to guess my name. So hit me one more time. Dupless. What? What did you just say? It can't be. The pixels on my my hat are glitching out. What the heck, Nintendo? Why? 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 How? 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 I'm feeling faint. Now it's our turn. Let's get your name and body back. Where'd he go to hide? Can I even go to the inn when I don't exist? See, people say the modern Paper Mario games are bad, but one thing you have to admit is good about them is that you can hit the NPCs. Hey, you again, eh, Slick? You're pretty stubborn to follow me all the way up here. Fine, fine. I see, I get it. Let's just put an end to this, son, shall we? Alright, kids. Put your fighting gloves, uh... Woohoo, it's-a me! Sure thing, Mario. We're right here with you. 
This creep couldn't take us on his own, so we te so we teamed up with a shadow side. You're gonna taste the pain, Gonzalez style, shadow guy. Or shadow guy, I did the wrong voice, whoops. Very well, my loyal ones. How dare this nameless guy challenge the great Mario. Mario? That the guy who stole your name and body is Mario. That means you're Mario. Yeah. I can't believe it. All this time I was helping Mario. I, I feel like an idiot. What's going on here? Fight with your girlfriend? Cannon. Well, don't expect any more sympathy from us, ghoulies. Guys, surely, surely the theme would not go that hard. See, your friends ditch you because you don't have the charisma of me, Super Mario. He really is the Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. I'm, I'm sorry, sis. This Mario is the only person who's ever been kind to me. Mario, I'm fighting by your side from now on. I have, I've made my choice, and I'm not turning back. Alright, and then, uh... Yeah. Nerd. Ratio. No! Why? How? He died. Eek! Mario! And then he explodes into star points. That's all the star points I've got in the game. I've only got 19 star points throughout this entire game. Oh. Level up! <laughs> Fun fact, if this were 64, I would already have the max amount of start of BP. <laughs> huh? It's a me. No, oh, he's sad. Rats! You killjoys! He just jumps out the window. What? He ran away. I mean, wait, what just what the heck is going on here? That wasn't the real Mario. Did we get shell linked? So, who's this girl, huh? Isn't she one of the shadow sirens you guys mentioned? Why would Gonzalez pair up with one of these creeps? Well, uh Mario. Yes. <laughs> that that's why. Because yes. Oh, Mario, thanks for sticking up for me. Well, thanks to her, I guess you came through this okay. No sweat, right? Uh, listen, Mario. Sorry about earlier. I'd be happy to travel with you if you'll have me. Vivian has really joined your party now. And now we really get the crystal star. This is for you. Yo, we get the crystal star that breaks the game, but I don't know how to use it. I've just heard that art attack is broken, but I've never been good at it. Your star power is now 5, and Mario learned a special move, Art Attack! Mario defeated the rogue who had stolen his name and appearance. Now Mario has 4 crystal stars, but there's a mere 3 more to find! And that means his quest to collect all the crystal stars is now more than half over. Now Mario heads off towards his new adventure with his new friend Vivian. But what about Beldum and Marilyn? What became of the doppelganger Dupless? What did become of the doppelganger Dupless? Yeah, Dupless is actually like a major character too. Or like not like a major character, but he he reappears. So he's even cooler. Um Oh yeah. Vivian is so very late. Where's that scat been all this time? Gah. And then there's just a devious dude. Alright, um now now it's gonna be a Peach section, and who cares what Peach says? So uh I'm going to end stream here.